Number one, focus. That number two is um, if you carry good stories from your past, if you carry good experiences on the desktop of your mind, if you carry good conversations, you bring them into the present, and bringing those good stories from your past into the present kind of launches you into a better future. It's like, you know, uh, if you look back in the rear view mirror of your life and you look at all things negative, there's no hope for you in the future. But if you look back and say, my life is wonderful, I've done great things and I've benefited from a lot, and you have stories like that, then they kind of fulfill you. If you're fulfilled with your past, then your present is alive. If your present is alive, then your future becomes a dream. It becomes heaven. Yeah? So the third principle, one of the principles, not the third, there are about seven or eight. So the third principle is that whatever good parts you carry of your past into the future, you create a better future. That's two. Uh, the third one, or the fourth one, might be realities change and realities are different. Uh, from where you're sitting at, you know, and you see me, that's your reality, me, an Indian man in his 50s. When I'm sitting here, I see you, a young, handsome Filipino man. So that's my perspective. So realities are different, and they change. They are constantly changing. You are constantly changing. The environment is constantly changing. The show, every few seconds, becomes new. Yeah? So there is no permanence. That means, of course, change is constant. Mm -hmm. you know, that's the old Gandhi statement. But what I'm saying is, that's a fact. Things are constantly changing. So you've got to be aware of that, that things are constantly changing. So how many uh, principles have I covered? One, uh, uh, that everything works, focus, and then uh, good things from the past, and there are multiple realities. And since there are multiple realities, there's got to be differences, right? So uh, if you are an European or an American or a, people, a person from Visaya, so uh, you are different than I am. So what appreciative inquiry says, there are differences. What you've got to learn is to appreciate the differences and discover what's good in them. That's the principle number five. There are a couple more which are similar, yeah. Okay.